Going crow. I think to maintain the order of a society filled with people of all kinds, to have an order, a code, some rules so people can't stick behind. Imagine if we didn't have any laws. What could have happened? Whoa, I see. A dark, chaotic and dangerous place. People would be able to do whatever they wanted and there would be no consequences for their actions. This could lead to a lot of crime. They wouldn't have to worry about being arrested or going to jail. The violence will spread without leaving any protection for our rights. I mean, most sexual predators would probably try to sexually assault either women or children. And most women would be scared to walk out of their house. Many pedophiles will burst their bubble and they will spread horribly all over. They will have the audacity to reveal their identities without any fear. <laughs> it's hard to believe what they would do to children. It's so disturbing even think about it. Inside their home, relationship breakdown and separation are time of increased risk of family violence. Without family law, families could be harmed or destroyed both physically and emotionally. When you look inside your home, you're exposed to domestic violence. Outside, you're pursued by evil forces, not to mention the psychological pain that will be caused by what surrounds you. Oh, oh my god. Earth is not habitable anymore. Let's gather all the good ones and let's run for our lives. Hmm. I think we can go to space. <laughs> Give me a rocket. <laughs> Let's continue. Both killers and serial killers will pack everything they can bring to possibly kill innocent people. So murders on the rise with no police session for them. Oh my god, this is so bad. <coughs> you can't smell pure air anymore because we're all high and gaining addiction. You walk around and find a bunch of people blowing smoke in your face. Weed and drugs are now legal. Hmm, I think most teenagers would be so happy with that decision. We see a look like Rue Bennett from Euphoria, and every time you're on the edge to overdose, make sure you've got yourself a friend like Elliot. Hello heart, I thought I lost you. No contract or copyright, you're now exposed to fraud, theft, and threats and we would not be able to hold anyone accountable for their actions. Innocent people will be like the walking dead. They would be surrounded by corruption and sick people. So they must learn to defend themselves, learning to fight and using guns. Because you know there are no more laws or courts. You've got to go back to the old ways and take your revenge by your own hand. And don't forget to shoot straight to the head. And with the weaknesses of the country, as we know from our study of history, it becomes easy prey for those invaders who are powerful. And now, look around, the system has broken down, it's on fire, everything is unable to balance. <laughs> Sorry listeners, I can't help it without seeing the horrible stuff happening. I don't know, maybe because I think our inner is evil, but how could we let the bad take down the good in ourselves? But that's not what we had to. Okay, back to law. So, as we figured, laws are the top weapon to decrease our dark side, the evil soul within our bodies. It provides a structure for society, tell us what we can and cannot do, and provide consequences for breaking the law. We are all now grateful for the existence of the law. Thank you. Bye.